Hey guys, Emily from Food Box HQ here. Today we're talking about grassroots. So grassroots is a farmer's co-op, which means there's all these different farms that work together to get you the best quality meat that you can buy. Say there's farmer A here and farmer B here. Farmer A may have a small group of chickens, farmer B might have a cow or two. They work together to bring you a full package of meat to send to you each month or you know whenever you want it to order. You can pick which pieces you get. You can get chicken breasts, chicken thighs, whatever you want. They've got turkeys, pork, beef, all the staples, but the way it works for the farmers, it allows smaller farmers to be able to sell their meat in larger quantities and allows you to consume better quality meats that aren't industry farmed. So let's take a look at what's in our box. All right, so we open up our box and we've got our packaging here. Inside that, we've got this really nice cooler bag which has all of our meats in it. There's obviously the paper that's gonna describe everything. When this came in, it had some dry ice in here, so everything was nice and frozen when it came in. Didn't have to worry about any of that. So let me just get this big box off the counter so that we can check out what's in the bag. So with the description, it just tells you, you know, all the things that you ordered, pricing, all of that fun stuff. But then in here is the good stuff. So we have boneless, skinless chicken breast, boneless chicken tenders, we have a bone broth mix, because that was something that I really wanted to try. We also have more, oh, this is turkey, ground turkey, ground beef, and last but not least, tenderloin steak. So on each of your meats, you'll also notice they have the farm that the meat came from, what the meat is, the lot number, and the packaging date. So you know when everything was done and how long it's been sitting and and all that. So we're gonna make a recipe today. We're gonna make some burgers just so that we can check out this ground beef. And I'm gonna make some homemade sweet potato fries with it too. All right, so let's do a taste test. Now, the fries, I obviously have to figure out the timing on. They're a little bit burnt, but we're talking about the meat today, so I'm not super worried about it. Oh, wow. It's really juicy. Still has a lot of the, um, a lot of the moisture to it. Didn't get dry. Even though I may have slightly overcooked it just a little bit. I like usually a medium rare, and I think I went a little bit more medium well. But, this is really good. So I'm gonna finish my dinner. I'll see you later. So just some final thoughts about grassroots. I loved the meat, it had a really great flavor to it. I really, really like the idea of a farmer's co-op. I think it gives the little guy a little bit of a leg up as well as the sustainability of it. You know, if you're very conscious of where your meat comes from and the quality of it and how sustainable it is and how it's raised, this is definitely a great company to check out. If you wanna learn more, click the link below.